<laughs> Hello, I'm Greg. I'm Marty. I'm Nader. And we're going to start Dragon Quest XI. Boy, oh boy. Did you see this? I'm sure you did. Oh, for what? What's that for? Kakarot. Oh, new character? Mm hmm. What's that for uh, fighters? No. No. That game has the driving mini game. It's we gotta we gotta do it when it comes out. <laughs> Square Enix. So apparently the progress is going to carry over from the demo, and it has a large game slice. Yep. Yeah. Huge amount. You of can game. get up to four party members. Mm-hmm. And before the demo ends, apparently after like ten hours. It asks you if you want to go back before your final, before the demo end, ends and just level up or whatever. And here we have a demonstration of the music that is exclusive to the Switch. Yeah, the one, orchestrated track. It's one reason, beautiful. One reason I don't want to get it on my PS4. Well, don't. Yeah, he just got into Smash, actually. Him and all the other, well, like three or four other yeah. heroes. Yep. <laughs> Here's the classic theme. I can't be on the PS4 orchestration. Oh, wait till you hear the the uh, battle music, Marty. It's so good. Yeah, so those three guys all were, have worked on every fo Dragon Quest, right? Yeah. These three guys. <laughs> Sounds right. What I want Square Enix to do, do a compilation of all the old Dragon Quests. Yeah. Oh, Especially, man. uh... Really? And that's what they need to do next for Final Fantasy. Give me a compilation of Final Fantasy 1 through 6. Yeah, Did we get 10? Compilation. What? Yeah. Did we ever get 10? I know 9 was on the DS, so uh, I never uh, got 10, to I heard they're working on a way to bring it over here. Okay, I hope so. I hope so, because I'd like to... I like to... You know me, I like to play a series in order. So if I could do it in order, that'd be great. Sure. But you can just play in it. It would be nice. Oh, Let's say this game is beautiful. Well, the, I mean, sure, but the music is like... You're immediately brought back. Uh, what do I call them? <laughs> Anything? No. What did it say about streaming and distribution, though? Are there issues with it? I should give him a, a fancy name. I have a couple of standbys that I use for my games. But... All right. Call him Toilet. No. Sure. <laughs> All right. I'll just call him my name. Gregor. Ah, oh, Gregor. Gregorat. Gregorat. <laughs> Gregorat. Actually, that's a good name. <laughs> Gregor. Um, are you sure? Are you happy to proceed with the name Gregor? Gregor. Mm. You don't want to do a combination of Kakarot and Greg? Gregorat? Well, I realize. Gregor. Gregorat. Greg. Greg. Ida. Good night. There we go. <laughs> yeah, well, let's play that. I okay. Music. We'll do 3D mode. Oh, I can't. We well, can't do TD in the demo. Oh. I can't wait to switch back and forth. The entire game you that can play is 2D. So Unreal. Unreal. So, Greg, waiting mm -hmm. on you, buddy. Oh. English. <laughs> that camera looking fine. Yeah. Brightness is good. <laughs> A 
There you go. Okay. Still than Toriyama uses for Dragon Ball? No, I don't think so. I mean, Toriyama doesn't sit there and do these designs, you know that, right? People, yeah, there's teams of people who imitate his art. I'm guessing the only character he probably designed himself is the main character. <laughs> That's it. He might have done the whole party. I highly doubt that. The funny story how he got involved, apparently they were looking for an artist to do this, uh, do the first game. They're like, we need an artist, and his editor was like, I know a guy who's jumping at the chance to do it. Toriyama was none the wiser. <laughs> Let's not get into that. <laughs> okay. Just saying. Looks like Krillin. <laughs> Voice acting in 8 was incredible. That, oh, yeah. That baby looks like Krillin. Maybe they'll be like this. I mean, all babies look like Krillin. Yeah. <laughs> well, Krillin's not a very hard design. I mean, he's bald. <laughs> Uh, well, the majority of Toriyama's characters look the same. Or so. his babies. Yeah, he's not very good. He's not exactly known for having a. Uh, he's not exactly known for having a variety of faces. <laughs> well, if the soul is in the eyes, let's just say that a lot of those uh, characters share the same soul. Yeah, you can tell what characters are villains by Toriyama's eyes. <laughs> No, oh, it's just like Moses. <laughs> yep. Well, that reminds me. You know the I'm old not that Moses guy. Yo, yeah, yeah, no. Is that um? Uh, I want him to go. You're standing the fish. And throw him away. <laughs> what were you saying about Moses? Yeah, uh, that, well, that's what I was gonna say. You know how the Superman movies have been so obsessed with making Superman into Jesus? I'm like, Superman is not Jesus. If anything, he's Moses. Mm, I guess. You know, he's got the power and everything, and he's like, I'm gonna save everyone. Or that's at least his goal. Moses was more like, I got a few people I gotta take care of. I'm guessing your playable character doesn't talk. Probably not. <laughs> but he can spare that doggy a smile. Uh -huh. Thanks. Thanks so much. You're a lifesaver. What? <laughs> This is one of those games where you don't Trust switch me. it over to a Japanese audio. I don't think, anyway. No. I'm gonna play the game in a language I can understand, thank you. 
Well, I mean, for like Yasuo, you obviously want to switch it over yeah. to Japanese and use the English subs. Seven in the style. Oh my god. <laughs> Did you play that to completion, Greg? What? Dragon Quest Seven? This is the first Dragon Quest game I've ever played. Really? Yeah. Oh well there's your gaming sin. Wow. I wasn't much of an RPG guy when I was younger. <laughs> yeah. He was gotta go fast! Get type of guy. Well, really? You weren't? Yeah, he was a Genesis guy. No, I was more of a platformer guy. Yeah, he was the Genesis. Huh. Action platformer. Dragon Quest VII was on the PS1. Humble folk of Cobblestone, great land spirits, hearth and home. The best That's smelling goes. instruction booklet ever had. Smell so, like. Dragon Quest, do you ever have the option to have a female playable character or no? Yeah. In, um... Well, I don't know if you can switch, per se, to as an option, but they have had, um... a guy and a girl. Um... For... It's not a mainline game. You couldn't even re you couldn't really call it that. But uh, in one of the Musos I played, Dragon Quest Heroes, you could switch. You could either be a male or a female. Uh, then I could see heroin being an echo for Hero in Smash Brothers. Oh yeah, they de will definitely do that. Here's the thing: we don't we know Banjo Kazooie's coming out. My guess is next month. Oh, he's the next. Okay. Yeah, Banjo Kazooie's next. I'm assuming that that's. Uh, we don't know who the, uh, we don't know who the, uh, who the next two are. Okay. I'm guessing one is Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> Why would that be? I mean, he was originally a semi-Sony uh, icon. Well, mascot. Yeah, 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 everyone's saying, um, it's Doom Guy. Doom Guy? I'm guessing she's a... Oh. Maybe she'll wake up to magic or something. Although I have a feeling she's just the, uh, the village friend. Oh. The call to adventure will happen soon. So this is... So we're doing turn-based battle. Hmm, okay. Yeah, but it looks like it's going to be a little bit different with the uh, red circle. I think yeah. you can run within that circle. Oh, no. So it's so it is different than other Dragon Quest. Well, hopefully, this is better than Final Fantasy 15. 15 was average. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, the, them's fighting words with Nader. Uh, yeah. The worst parts of 15 are still better than the best parts of Sonic the Hedgehog. Shut up. <laughs> I was uh, no, I, I go, I'm guessing I was going to say you'd rather play 15 than 13. Anybody would. Just about anybody, I would say, yeah. Thir is 13 really that bad? 13's on rails until, like, two-thirds of the way in, and then you finally get to uh, explore around. You know, the thing that you expect to be able to do in a Final Fantasy, or in an RPG in general, you don't expect to be led by the nose everywhere that you're going. What's this thing? Mm-hmm. Cute. And I think they felt that they had to take that kind of an approach because of all the backlash that 12 got back in the day. I thought people liked 12. Well, in retrospect, people liked 12. Yeah, 12 has a lot more fans now than it did before. Those assholes. To be fair, though, with the Zodiac uh, 
edition. This is the superior version of the game, which we didn't matter. have. They should have been there in the beginning. That's true. I agree. We were there. Where were you? Pepperidge Farm remembers. Oh, there's another slime. Really? You can hit them. <laughs> they don't care about sight. I okay. was like, I think you run around them. Yeah. yeah. I'm guessing she'll actually start fighting later. No, I'm no, she's not a party member. Oh, well, she's, she's a town friend, I think. She's passively healing you, though. That's nice. Yeah. Well, I remember Final Fantasy 15 had a uh, had a character who would heal you, but she was only temporary. <laughs> It'll be. <laughs> I really hope the mic didn't pick that up. <laughs> I kind of do. We needed additional sound. You're supposed to attack them. You can run around them, Greg, if you want. Okay. So what was the first RPG you played then? Sonic RPG on DS. No! <laughs> Final Fantasy IV, I think. Really? When did you play it, though, if you weren't like a big RPG guy? 2011, I think. So you didn't play it on the SNES? I played it on the Virtual Console. Okay. Somebody, like, somebody, my, I have a friend who really wanted me to play Final Fantasy games, so he sent me Final Fantasy IV as a gift. It's a good one to start with. But he told me to skip the first three. Yeah, I mean, two's weird. I heard two's kind of bad. Two is weird as hell. I, I. Oh, there we go. Does this look better on PS4? Or is this? Um. Yeah, know. slightly. But the music's totally different. It's on MIDI. Yeah. I love the way the drums kick in every time you start a battle. Okay. And with all the brass yeah, the music it's used. The drums. I love it. There's so much lushness and what are we missing in the music playing it on the PS4. Marty's a sad boy. Oh, what the? Oh. I didn't know. Well, at least this game, you are, you can actually see the enemies coming. So I guess I'm the only one then who would who would know here. But Dragon Quest Seven would be just amazing to see redone. Because Dragon Quest Eight, I mean, it doesn't look as good as this, but it's still like it was a marked jump up in graphics because it was no longer uh, sprite based. And the characters weren't like kind of squat. They were like fully rendered, kind of like this. But it was so huge. It was four discs. Something like that. On the PS1. And it wasn't like a cutscene extravaganza, like, you know, yeah. the. Final Fantasy of old for the PS1, so those were just, that was just jammed with content. I think I put like 200 something hours into that game. Yeah. Getting everything. How many hours did you put into, uh, in, into 7? Did I put into 7? Yeah. Actually, I put, actually, here's the thing. I've played Chrono Trigger, but I've never played Chrono Cross. Uh, that's an acquired taste. I, I wouldn't you, say you missed that much. Here's what I heard, remember you saying when I asked you about it. I said, you were like, you know, Chrono Cross wasn't a bad game, but it wasn't really a sequel to Chrono Trigger. It's it's not. I, I mean, it shares similar themes with, like, you know, using time to break up the narrative and things like that, but it didn't... I don't know. It, it didn't do what Chrono Trigger did. Uh... And any narrative links between them, I'm struggling to remember if there's any. Do you, uh, do you remember if there were? What? 
with Chrono Cross? Quick, what? You have to open. Were they, was it linked with Chrono Trigger, really? Uh, there were a couple hints, yeah. Oh, wait, you know what? Um, Lucia, or, uh, what's her name? The inventor. Yeah. She showed up briefly yeah. from Chrono Cross. It's not fog at all. It's more monsters. I don't know how you do a Chrono game without Chrono. I don't either, but it happens. 